You see that? You see that? All black man, black track, they're on my farm. Got a couple cowboy scars up on my arm. Don't need ADP, this shotgun's my alarm. And I let that thing sing like the strings on my guitar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I let that thing sing, that thing sing. Welcome back to my channel, man. Hey, I know I've been gone for, for a little minute or so, but I was gonna come back with a bang, man. Y'all see I got my Davis Mills jersey on, man. I was just about to set up my gaming setup and like record a whole like video. Pretty much explain to y'all why Go Mills, Davis Mills is the goat you know what i'm saying but as you can see um yeah man god got different plans man so my big beautiful tv man we i just moved in my new crib um it's about to sit up my little gaming setup and everything over here man you know it's about to sit my stuff up plugged up my tv and as you can see i got a big crack so i'm gonna tell y'all exactly what needs to be done to fix this problem see most people will take this tv this i think it's a 65 inch they'll take their 65 inch tv and they'll just throw it away but you're lazy all right everybody knows that google will give you all the answers you need if not google then youtube and youtube is google's the same thing so um if you haven't came across the video yet to tell you how to fix this problem which is pretty much a crack in the screen as you can see right here there's a crack uh, let me let me do something real quick. Let me. I ain't got my remote. Boom. There we go. So that's what it looks like when it's not black. Man, that sucks, y'all. 65 inch TV. But like I said, man, I'm gonna show y'all how to fix this problem. If you got a crack here, that's okay. If you got a crack across, that's okay. Even if you have a crack going down, even if you got a crack right in the middle, I'm gonna show y'all how to fix that problem. So man, stay tuned. Um, hopefully this video isn't too long. I'm gonna try to get straight to it and get y'all the answers y'all need. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and turn the TV a little bit y'all way, just a little bit more so y'all can see it better. All right, so y'all gonna be surprised that like, you really don't need much. It, everybody who dry their clothes, y'all got these, right? I, I know y'all do. If you got a wife or girlfriend, you know, those men, sometimes we just don't need none until we know. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, hey, if you got one of these, man, then you good to go, man. This is um like, you put them in the dryer to make the clothes smell better, but you'll be surprised this little thing can fix this big problem, okay? So, um, first thing you wanna do is, you wanna, don't worry about the parts that wasn't cracked, that wasn't hit. I'm assuming that this came from when I was transporting it from my last house to my new one, maybe my truck, uh, maybe my son slammed the door on it, or maybe I did, I don't know, I don't blame nobody else. Maybe that's what happened, but whatever happened, it don't matter what the impact was, all you need is this right here, okay? So you're gonna take this, and you're just gonna. You see how you see how the screen is flickering a little? You see that? You see that? You just rub it, rub it. Now you have to be careful. You see how the you see how the screen was is clearing up a little bit more up top, and it's taking it away a little bit. You have to be careful because you don't want to apply too much pressure. If you apply too much pressure, you could actually make it worse and the whole screen can go black. So you really want to be very careful with this. So again, you kind of want to massage the spot where it's at. You got to be patient. Remember, it's just it might look like it's getting worse like that. But you just got to kind of figure out where the main spot is. You're going to hit a specific spot. Hold on, let me make sure y'all can see all this in frame. Okay, I'm a little out of frame, so I'm going to go like here. Sorry if y'all can't see that clearly. But if you miss the spot like the TV got worse, that can happen. And that's okay. Just continue to massage the spot and you see we back, right? So continue to massage the spot. And what's going to happen is the part that was impacted the most, and, and, the, and that's what happens if you apply too much pressure. But that's okay. It's not over yet, okay? The part that was impacted the most, you have to use the fibers. I don't know if it's like electron, electric, electric fibers. There's fibers in this that will actually make everything go back 
to how it was. Okay, so as you can see, we have a black screen. So if, you, if your screen goes black, it's simple. All you have to do is turn it off. Give us like a reset. Mine's you have to hold it. Then turn it back on. Don't panic, all right? If, you're, if, you're, if you make it worse, don't panic. It's, it's okay. It happens. You turn it, turn it back on. We'll give it time to reboot, and then um, we'll pick up from there. Okay, so it's been about 10 minutes. I let it reboot. Um, I took my, my, uh, my, my dryer sheet, and I, I tried to um, pretty much get it back to where it was, and it didn't work, and that's okay. Um, if you get to this point where you've made it worse, um, there's another solution, okay? Um, so we're not going to use the dry sheet no more, but don't panic because there's one more solution, okay? So I'm going to actually sit that down. I'll be right back. This is the last solution. This, nine times out of ten, works every time. So give me about 15 seconds, and I'll be right back. And there you have it. Problem solved. Buy new TV. All black man, black chat, they're on my farm. Got a couple cowboys cars up on my arm. Don't need ADP, this shotgun's my alarm. And I let that thing sing like the strings on my guitar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I 